protests against the IMF and World Bank turned hot and heavy on the 25th of April. Before protest was even deployed, the news was reporting that windows had been smashed at PNC Bank, Wachovia Bank, and a condominium, with PNC Bank alone taking 14 broken windows. Protesters finally deployed at about 7 a.m. Units took to the streets all over the city, finally converging by the World Bank while the police turned out an armored vehicle and all kinds of brutality trying to keep people off the street. Nonetheless, protesters succeeded in taking the streets for almost three hours, although blockades were not successful. All those DC cops weren't very happy about having protesters marching in the streets talking about tearing down capitalism. The police, desperate to regain control of the streets, opened fire with pepper spray against a crowd, forcing people over a fence into a park, pepper spraying 30 people, and sending one person to the hospital with a broken leg. They pepper sprayed us. They sprayed us in the mouth and the eyes and the skin. I was wearing glasses, but they, got, they put the pepper spray under my eyes and in my mouth. Uh, as far as I know, they were trying to get everybody on the sidewalk, and there's not enough room on the sidewalk. There's a fence and some bushes, and they decided to start pushing people from the sidewalk over the fence, and it wasn't working, so they sprayed into the crowd and probably hit about 30 or more people. They just used it like a machine gun on a crowd. Yeah, I would say about that much, definitely.